Hello and welcome to Bearing It All in the Kitchen. My name is Matthew Beausoleil, chef of Bear Magnet TV. We're gonna show you a simple and delicious dish that will wow your hunting party. Today we're making wild bear shepherd's pie. Let's get cooking. All bear meat used during Bearing It All in the Kitchen has been harvested by Bear Magnet TV Pro Staff. Let's see today's ingredients. Ground bear, frozen corn, frozen peas, beef broth, butter, Worcestershire sauce, and fresh chopped onions. Let's get cooking. We've preheated our titanium exclusive pan and we're ready to add our butter and onions. We're now going to let our onions simmer in the butter and when they become translucent we'll add in our peas and corn. The onions are nice and translucent, tender, we're now going to add in our peas and our corn. We're going to incorporate them well with the onions, we'll let them warm for a couple minutes and then we'll add in our ground bear. Our onions, corn, and peas are ready to go. We're gonna add in our ground bear meat. We'll add it in small chunks. We'll season our beef with sea salt season from up high to get even distribution and fresh cracked pepper. We're going to give it a good stir and once the meat is ready we'll move on to the next step. Our bear meat is fully cooked. We're now going to add in our beef broth. our Worcestershire sauce, mix it well, we're going to reduce our heat to low and let it simmer for about 10 minutes and then we're ready to plate it into the casserole. We're now ready to assemble our shepherd's pie. We're going to take our beef and vegetable mixture, place it into our casserole. Level out the mixture. And now it's time to top with our mashed potatoes. Try and coat it as evenly as possible. Once 
once the surface is covered properly, we can make little peaks by just tapping our spatula, which will result in a nice end product. We're now going to place our casserole in a preheated oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 30 minutes until our potatoes are nice and golden brown. We've removed our shepherd's pie from the oven. We've got a nice brown color, nice peaks. It's ready to plate. Top it with some parsley, fresh cracked pepper. Well, there you have it, Wild Bear Shepherd's Pie. It will surely impress your guests. For this recipe and more, check back to BearMagnetTV.com. I'm Matthew Beausoleil for Bearing It All in the Kitchen. We'll see you soon. Ciao.